All right, this is the proof of cosine rule. Because of the time, I have generated a triangle, A, B, C. And then, oh, sorry, there's a mess here. A, B, C. And given that the opposite side of C, angle C is C, and always do so. I have also find out drawn, construct the H, which is the height of the triangle, which is C, which, and then, which breaks C into X and C, C minus X. So there we go, let's get started. So we have the area of triangle equals to, no, we don't need area of triangle this time. I need Pythagoras theorem this time. So when we're looking at this angle, I have h squared plus x squared equals to b squared. Very happy, isn't it? And then I will look at the other side of the triangle. I will have <coughs> h squared plus c minus x all squared equals to a squared, right? Today, our guess is a. We need to find a in terms of something. All right, a squared maybe. So I'm going to expand this one, x squared plus c squared minus 2 cx plus x squared equals to a squared. All right, and then further you elaborate that, I will need, I will want to remove the h. So h squared will be equals to b squared minus x squared. If I substitute this one over, I will get b squared minus x squared plus c squared minus 2cx plus x equals to a squared. I will put the a in the front. All right, I need the red. All right, so I will have the minus x and plus x, sorry, plus x squared gone. So now I will have b squared plus c squared minus 2cx. Now we look back to our triangle. I need a cosine. I got given then a cosine a. So cos A will be equals to X over B. So X will be equals to B cosine A. Therefore, I will have B squared plus C squared minus 2C B cosine A. Need to be a bit fancy. So B square, A squared will be equals to B squared plus C squared minus 2BC cosine A. And you may ask, and therefore, we have, if we have any set of triangle, we got an angle here. I'll call that theta, whatever angle it is. So the two sides will be our, a, our B and C. All right, and we will find the third side. All right, no problem at all. But if we got a case that we have another triangle, we only have the three side, a, B, and C, and we need to find the angle. Then, again, the, ang the line, the side included the angle will be our A, B. So we have cosine C equals to A squared plus B squared minus C squared over 2AC. You may ask that, how does it happen? So we will have A, uh, sorry, C squared then. So how do we get that? By, we have A squared plus b squared minus 2ab cosine c equals to c squared, yeah? But I want to leave the c on the other side, so I'll throw it, leave that onward. So a squared plus b squared minus c squared equals to minus 2, uh, sorry, plus, equals to ab cosine c. This is multiplied, so I throw the other side on it, so I have a squared plus b squared minus c squared, over to a b equals to cosine c and i should be happy if i were you 